Hi friends this is HP 15 type laptop this keyboard was some keys are not functional so we are replacing this keyboard this is not simple type of keyboard this is internally fixed keyboard so we have to open all the all the cover all the components and we have to fix this one so let me show you how to do it first you have to flip the laptop and check all the screw portion and remove all the screws all the screws are not same it will be some different in the size and length at first you have to remove the battery and check where where it is the screws are there all the laptops are not same it will be different from one by one different to different like that on my left hand side you can see one some crack is there on the cover that one is uh, the hinges was problem so you need to be change the otherwise the cover will be damage this is the new keyboard so you have to be fix this keyboard so i can show you how to do it remove all the screws Check again all the screws are removed now almost all are removed now we can remove the cd drive from the tray this drive is push and pull function now we are removing the cover case three clip lock are there just we have to touch and uh, remove the clip now remove the support push button downstairs there is uh, two screws are there from the hinges screws supporting
Now you can remove the back cover. Back cover, nothing is there. Just, um, just supporting only back cover. All the components are on the keyboard tray. Now remove the hard disk. Now remove the strip connector from the motherboard. Keep it aside. Remove the USB port connector from the motherboard. And remove the motherboard screws, fixing screws. Remove the strips from motherboard, the optical drive connector and remove the strip from motherboard, the keyboard connector. And remove the touchpad connector and the speaker connector. Remove the screw from the network adapter. Remove the cooling fan connector. Remove the power adapter connector. Remove the power button connector and uh, keep it aside and also remove the cooling and uh, remove the power strip connector aside under this uh, there is the keyboard so this is little bit uh, difficult to remove this is rivet type uh, metal board so it is uh, not easy to remove it will hardly you have to do to remove and remove the metal this is the keyboard now removing the old keyboard and replacing to the new keyboard and keep it properly and press the each side to fix it with the clip make sure all it is fixed properly after this it's finished now reverse back all the things back then it's completed before closing once again you have to check everything it's okay everything is functional then finish thank you bye